Okay, so this is the Clone Scout Walker. This came out in 2005. Uh, it was originally uh, only 10 bucks, and uh, you can find one now for uh, not too much more, about 15 20 dollars. Um, and it's uh, 108 pieces. Uh, and like I said, it's called a Clone Scout Walker, but it is pretty much um, an ATRT. Uh, or, um, yeah, Clone Scout Walker or ATRT. Basically the same thing uh, all terrain, reconnaissance transport. Um, nice little set. A couple of you guys have asked for a review of this, so I thought I would do one. Um, before I go too much further, uh, I know there wasn't videos the last two weeks. Um, I have been very, very, very busy with work lately and I haven't even uh, found time to even uh, shoot a video for you guys, so I'm sorry about that. Um, I tried to post a bulletin saying I didn't know when I would be able to make another video, but like I said, work just turned out to be a lot crazier than I thought it was going to be, and um, I wasn't able to plan ahead and make a video earlier, and I, then I just got stuck working 9 and 10 hour days. Um, and getting home tired and not feeling like doing anything so that is the reason for that um, the other reason that you're seeing an old set right now is because a lot of my money is being poured into a new car that I recently got it's a new old car so it's being rebuilt and restored right now uh, and when that's all done I'll do a video on that um, let you guys know so you guys can see what kind of car it is and uh, the work that's being done to it, so that's pretty exciting. But uh, just thought I'd do a quick little review for you. Um, here's a size comparison with the Battle for Endor ATST. You can see it's actually a pretty good size for a tiny little set. It's got some height to it, um, but it's not bad. Uh, it works well with any little clone army that you have um, as a filler, kind of a filler unit. Um, but it's nice, you get this one clone, and uh, he sits up here at the controls. And does kind of cling on there. There we go. You get a, a nice little clone. Um, and he has an interesting, interesting design, I'm not sure what classification of trooper he is. But uh, standard episode 3 clone with. Um, all black head and a notched helmet, um, but a nice little figure. Uh, and then you get the old, old school style gun, the kind of the megaphone blaster that he can use. So there's that. Uh, and then the the head or the the front of it is on a swivel, so you can turn it side to side. You can also adjust this kind of front armor plate. Um, as well as move the gun a little bit. And the legs can be fully posed, they're all on, uh, all the leg joints are on ratchets, so you have toe movement, mid leg, and hip movement as well. So you can pose it, and you can see I've got them in kind of a, a walking stance right there. Got one foot in front of the other. So, but the actual um, base of the vehicle doesn't rotate. Just the uh, the front nose, so nice little easy set. Um, nice review. Uh, I will be getting some new sets um, soon, but not incredibly soon. Like I said, uh, a lot of my money is going into my car right now, so I will try to do um, as many videos as I can in the meantime before I get some new sets. Uh, I know the new. 2011 summer sets are on their way out. Uh, if you know where to look and you got the money, you can buy them on eBay already um, from Europe. I've seen a couple on there. I've seen a couple Republic frigates. I've seen a couple um, uh, pod racer sets. I've seen a couple Sith infiltrators from 2011. They are very expensive since they're not out in the U.S. Um, pretty much anywhere else except for Europe yet. So if you have the money, you can buy them now. Um, I don't right now. So, just going to wait um, and get them when they're officially released. So, that is that for you, though. Nice little set, though. Uh, definitely worth checking out. Like I said, shouldn't be more than 15 or 20 bucks. Um, it'd be worth it to get a couple of these. I think these are a lot better, better than the ones you get in the battle packs. 
uh, a lot more detail and uh, a little bit bigger. So pretty nice little set. Um, eBay or Bricklink probably would be the best place to get this. And um, that is that. So I will do my best to have a video for you guys next week. And I appreciate your patience and waiting. Um, try to do a video every Thursday uh, as well as um, trying to answer all your questions and, and your comments and your messages as best I can. So thank you guys for watching and subscribing. Also, thank you for giving me, uh, I have now over 3,000 subscribers, which is very exciting. So thank you guys for that. Um, hope to double that number and uh, keep on going from there. So thank you guys for all that, and I'll see you guys next Thursday.